right guys, we got me and my buddy Austin Smith. We're heading down to Georgia. We're gonna meet up with the guys from On The Prowl, my buddy Jordan Dawson. He uh, invited us to come down tonight, so we're gonna do a little bit of hog hunting, do some coyote hunting. Main thing is gonna be killing some hogs. Um, if we end up killing one, this will be mine and Austin's first hog, so we'll see how it goes. The weather looks like it's gonna be great. It's supposed to get down to, I think he said, low 60s high 50s but everything looks really good we got a good little while till we get to georgia but first stop is going to be bass pro ain't that right that's right we're going to go out there and go see what all kind of sales and goodies we might be able to look at and see but y'all stay tuned hopefully there's going to be some bullets getting slung and some hogs and coyotes on the ground get some good footage for you guys and hope y'all enjoy everything stay tuned where you at austin we had the Bass Pro. All right, guys, met up my buddy Jordan. There's old Jordan right there fueling up. We get ready to go after some hogs. So, see what happens. Y'all stay tuned. Hopefully, we can get on a big old group of them. Think we'll find some, Jordan? Oh, yeah. Hope so. So, see what happens. down the line. that back dog with him. Okay. You got you gonna stay on me dog when you on back? It's under two hundred. Yep. Y'all got lead dog. Ready? Good shooting, guys. Good shooting. All right, guys, that's a wrap. So, didn't get on really. We got on a group of hogs, but couldn't make a move on them. They stayed in tall corn. So, I switched gears and went after coyotes from 3.30 to 6.30 this morning. Shot at 12 dogs. Lost four to the tall grass, but still managed to uh, put eight on the rack. So, it's pretty fun. Had excitement. Killed two black coyotes, a couple regular ones, so 
great time. Can't wait to do it again. Thank you, Jordan, and all the guys on on the Prowl Outdoors, and can't wait to do this again. Thanks again, guys. All right, guys. So, me and Austin Smith got back from Georgia about six this evening, and we got a wild hare, and you know we're gonna try to go out and see if we can't kill some coyotes um, up here in Virginia. The weather's actually really cool. It's supposed to drop down to like high 50s tonight. So, we got a couple other buddies that are already out hunting. And they've been telling us the coyotes have been moving pretty well. So, hopefully, if everything works out, we'll be able to kill some dogs tonight as well. And add that up to uh, what we had the other day in Georgia. But, um, we'll see what happens. Y'all stay tuned. dogs in the field hit a little pup pal and ended up on one that was uh coming out into the field so ended up laying a hammer on it and try to go hunt another side of this farm and loot move back over here to another end try to get on the other two guys we've seen see how this goes one for the night so far. and just killed his first blonde to kill his first black coat in Georgia and then just shot him a big old male blonde how's it feel What's buddy up? how's it feel the night's still young got a few more spots to go to I know one thing this farm's definitely producing we were right up on top of these dogs too can't tell you a secret that we used to call men but it's been pretty good last couple nights oh yeah I mean we were in within what Two, 250 of them dogs. Probably wasn't even that, probably more like about 150 yards. Yeah, and this dog came running in. I mean, it about knocked the call over. But after that, didn't get it on video. I had another coyote, and Austin will vouch for me, won't you, Austin? Yep. Had a coyote at 460 yards, and it sat down. I shot, and that thing just dropped. So we're getting ready to load up and go get this other dog so y'all can see it. All right, guys. Here's the dog at 460, and guess what? It's a pup. Roll old noggin shot. Can you see the laser? I don't know if y'all can see it. Yeah, there's the laser way over there. So, to the dome, 460. Let's see if we can get any more. All right, guys, so that's a wrap. Me and Austin are completely wore out. Um, End of the night with three dogs. Got that off of one farm. I heard several other dogs, but kind of just gonna let them sit for next time we come on in. Pretty sure we found the den on those dogs, so next time we're gonna get in there, we got a better idea where to set up. But all in all, not a bad night. Um, we ended our weekend with, what was it? Was it 11 dogs we had on the rack this weekend? Yeah. 11 dogs on the rack this weekend, so. Not bad, not too bad. But hopefully uh, next time we do another video for you guys, we'll end up killing some more dogs for you guys. So if you haven't, like, subscribe, and y'all keep killing. <laughs>